So it is uh, Wednesday, and of course, you know how it be every Wednesday. Barrister Dolis Day here to come talk about Lega Mata, we will call on Liga Mata, or join. And I just matter where we say, uh, if we late, well, when it starts, marriage day, like you talk, everything, almost everything for this life, get Lega implications around. You see, money, Lega day, dear. You see, marriage, Lega day, dear. After marriage, what do they call divorce? How to take your child, children's them. Uh, Lega day, dear. But, Kinimomo, Kilomademo, I'm just a child. That's how we bring a, a barrister to come to Shook Mart every Wednesday onto those legal, legal things. Barrister, good morning. No, we don't know. No, we don't. No, we don't for house. So. No, no, we don't for house. Don't come now. We got no one. <coughs> I'm not there for a house. Yeah. With me here are uh, Slimmy T. And on my left is Ferro. <laughs> it's a gentleman. And in mm -hmm. the middle, it's very sad. Abi. And then behind the camera, honorable panel of judges. I'm going to be the And the colors. And the colors. And the colors. Colors. I'm not there. Very well, very sad. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, we're talking about the. Uh, well, after marriage, the. The welfare of uh, uh, children, the children, and things like that, you know, uh, post divorce, after divorce, um, the rights of children, or what will happen to the children or the affairs mm. of the family. Um, the, the thing where, where we stopped last one time we talked, we say most times the court. They will consider the interest of a child. And uh, when they consider the interest of a child, the court no go look and see who get money pass. That's why um, after that year, yeah, last week or so, some people call me. One person call me, say, the woman, or the woman I call me, say, now she they take care of the children since they don't debat. And the man, every time, probably will give him 2,000, 1,000. The man just they do, they buy things, buy a car, buy that one. But not they take care of those children. But the thing we said, the children love the man. Perhaps they love their mama. Now, who will come take, as they don't, say the man don't, you know, end so. Who will take the children? Because he say, our life and our children know. Mm -hmm. So we say based on what they talk, say the interest of a child. And because say when they go court now, if you say those children fit talk, say they go father. go with their father because they like their father, not be small, and things like that. So the answer we are giving say true true. Sometimes now you be in the position to be like the one the provider mm -hmm. for the children. But if that provision if the court can look it objectively, say, ah, with that provision, you know, if you get, if you be say a provider, we say, you know, the, you know, be a carer. Yeah. It be, I don't know how to explain that. Because sometimes... In fact, they give money, no me say... Yeah, they because they sometimes they give those money the out of anger. Mm. Your father don't give me. Mm. And the one I give you. You know, that's so that sometimes they visit the anger. Affection, The, yeah, uh, is, like say, the children, uh, uh, the children, the, the, they didn't get there the brunt of the mm. disaffection we get for the ogre. So the children don't like you, but they like the money they give them. Yeah. Eh? And then so the, the, the boss man. So in that circumstance, the court will look at, okay, make a judge where well look. This man, probably not be, you know they allow the man to bring money. Or probably the man not even get money himself. But okay, the interest of the children, how would they be served? So the court can look, okay, let give now custody. Okay, two of now get joint custody. Okay, you go give, give they stay with you, hmm. you go to give them money. But for the affection where they go miss for their father, hmm. once in a while, the father go have visiting rights, or the father, if the father don't come off from the house, the father also will, will get custody hmm. of the of the children. So generally, nobody say the court they go lean one side. And like say now you get money, pass, no me say. 
the right, you get the right pass to that children. It's like say another one we say, people they, you know most times when the children they from from early years, like from one or from zero, zero months till about six, they say it's better make the child day for the the mom, the mom and. Okay. But sometimes you get some mothers who say they are not good mothers. Mm. Even though naturally, if you expect them to be the one to, to take care, there. you can get the mother who say even all through from zero to, to six that we're talking about, the child has always been given to mm. uh, nanny. nanny or daycare. The woman is a, from Dubai to Lagos, from Lagos to New she whatever, business businesswoman. Or even if the businesswoman, a kind of job that she does. Uh, is moving from where, but, uh, yeah, company. or probably it's like she, she, and some women go to say, okay, now because I mean they bring all the money, uh, for the family, I cannot afford not to have my work. Mm. So, uh, Lani, I pay mm. money for Lani, or God, if you want to take care, take care. So to go, out, so they are not even there for that child. Yeah. To the extent that the man can say, okay, yes, this child is small, but this woman does not have emotional attachment to this mm -hmm. child to say that if the child will be missing anything. The nanny or probably sometimes you are giving the child to your mother or your, to your mother-in-law. Mm. Eh? So your mother-in-law is the one that is taking care of oh, this child. child and the mother-in-law is so um, well attached to the child such that if you guys leave, uh, call, Mark can say, look, my mother is actually the one taking care of this child. So it's not as if it's the woman that's taking care of, of this true. child. So on that basis, the court can say, okay, the welfare of the child, even though it's, a, it's still a small child, the welfare of the child all will be well taken care of by this mother-in-law. Mm. So the custody can be given to that man so that the mother-in-law can extend the taking care of yeah, it. Sure. And then the, the woman, mm. woman can also come, come to visit her house. Okay. Visiting, visiting right. So these are all the uh, possibilities that will that will go on. And then when they are in school, when they are in school, um, it, it all depends on how they are able to prove their case very well. Uh, because sometimes you have a situation where the man, um, the woman or the man is the one paying the school fees, okay. but the man. Just like we are trying to vice versa, uh, make with children like that. Now the man they pay the school fees, but the woman are in it with the children. If they fail marriage, because uh, I don't see some people who say they carry my children come out. Mm. I never see my children all this time, mm. and because of that, I don't go pay school fees again. Now everybody look watching me because you have to be very careful. But that's why I keep saying that um, the best thing for you. It's not to go into marriage at all. Mm -hmm. You can't go into marriage and make the marriage fail. Can't be as against. Yes, it's, seriously. Because I don't see them at different levels psychologically. Mm -hmm. It's in the kind of effect they have on those For children. Because that's not a fight over who will pay school fees. The damage not be one day damage. Oh. The, the damage is a day for almost forever mm -hmm. for those children. And some of those children, I get one time some children they say that as if, as if we say made the bonus. As if we said that we should make the bonus, the come bonus, come they put us for uh, because it's, be, it's between whether you go, go with me or you go mm. come with me mm. and those kind of things. You know, so even before you get to court, before the court will say we decide, say that so we want the children go be. So many times the damage we don't do for. Yeah, already. Uh, no, you can imagine even when sometimes say okay, uh, make the child decide we he won't follow because mm. probably the court. Don't they confuse? Okay, this one don't bring in case mm -hmm. to show say like the child. The child they go there better care for himself. Man, that other man, the man also don't bring case. <laughs> say now nah, they take and go Dubai, and they, uh, whatever. So, uh, so the other and the, so at the point in time, the child can't they confuse. Sometimes the judge will tell the child go to social chambers. Okay. Oh. Okay. Yes. Say the child go to social chambers. Go talk to her, Mike. Say, mm, you know, okay. they look their face uh -huh. so who you want? Who do you want to go with? And even say no, see their faces for physical. In they see yeah, their face for least. mind. Yeah. So it's like, how could I be choosing who I want? So mm. they kind of thing. So making that they think I'm very well. And now they go to those divorce matter for the sake of his children. Because I was talking about 
So that the man they pay school fees, the woman now they take care of the child. Okay, because of that divorce, and because the children can't talk, see, they won't go with the mother. Mm -hmm. You can't talk, say, you know, go pay um, school fees again if they go with the mother. So the children, the, the, the court can give what is called maintenance order. Okay. Say, you must pay those school fees mm. for those children. I understand him. Say, mm. the court can say, they can say, that's what we're going to do. Otherwise, um, the children will go suffer. And it's also possible that if you don't pay it, that would be say if they if, if court don't give that kind of order, and the person no pay them, that means that contempt of court, and the person will be arrested. Okay. If I even go to jail for it, just like most times in this part of the world, you are wondering well, how can I take the children, the father of my children, to court, hmm. to jail? But it's very po abroad. You don't. It can you, you, no, no, no. It's that now is a given. Hmm. It's a given. Once they don't give that order, and you don't give that money. Uh, no, 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 forget. Number one, they go seize all your credits. Number two, you don't know, even trust that because mm, at, all. at all, at all. Because once they don't do that one for all your credits, because now card they almost of them they use. Mm. You know if it's pay anything. So they can and when they catch you, eh, for the fine court order, that jail. And once you don't go to jail, and you don't do for your records, you don't go to jail. Every every worker, every person who will employ you. When they want to do uh, yes, background the check, yeah. they go Sam. So the man go they rush to mm. go pay the money. In fact, not the only black men in the pay. <laughs> <laughs> they, go, they, they go they move from state to state, running around. So now if you say <laughs> make you know where where. So when God don't give that order, make you pay, pay, pay and pay. And then for the woman, if you know if you get the money from and I, you know and I won't talk about forget about court now. It gets and that's level with it. Also, do before you go court uh, for like for Lagos and get social uh, social welfare. Um, Ministry of Youth Sports. How, uh, how active is that one? The day the only thing you say when you go that one, not be mm. court. Now persuasion, please. They go call the man, call the woman, try Don't to um, try to make them reason. Mm. See, because of these children, no, they give this man money. Uh, because of these children, no, they do this one, they do that one. This, this welfare now before they divorce proper proper. I mean, after they even after. Divorce. Okay. Uh, after you know you know because sometimes eh, some divorce people know they because when you want to do divorce now nah, you have to think very fast. That's why it's very torturous and like a mere emotional process. But some people they don't even want, at that point in time they don't even want to allow. They just want okay, we could just come out. Then be that divorce. Mm -hmm. Now even they don't come out. Oh. Then the eye go come oh, open. open. Say, oh, wait. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Who go pay this for? Who go do this one? The gas, where the man they don't buy before, before, for the 2000 now. <laughs> now they buy the gas now. So all those things go combine. So if you go court after you don't even divorce, yeah. to say that court, I want, um, I want the process to do what is called um, um, maintenance. maintenance and issue of the children. Mm -hmm. You understand me? So, but the best thing is to do it at the same time. Mm -hmm. And that's why so, so many people, when they want to do divorce, they don't want that aspect, the pain them pass. Mm -hmm. That I go lose my child. Yeah. I go yeah. lose my whatever. It depend them pass. So many of them no, no want to do them because of that aspect. So, but they, if you move, so they, can, they move up, so separate. So that's the question when you ask me, say, if it be after they, mm -hmm. they don't do divorce, or if you be say okay, they never do divorce, but they don't they don't get together or yeah. or things don't happen. Or maybe say it don't happen, you know. And sometimes even say they never even marry. They just give themselves belly. Eh? And then the the man say the woman carry go. You know, you get one with them now two times. They get children for each other. And they don't marry. And the woman they leave you alone. So you can't go. So in that sense, you can't really go to court to say you won't go do divorce. Because they're no marriage. What huh? they go for? Um, so they they go for. Most times, can you know? Because the basis of even seeking for court study mm. has to be said that there's something like a marriage. For mm. so the best place to go in that sense will be welfare. Okay. Yeah? But welfare, if you use the law against the person, and they will not pass more. So persuasion. what if at the end of the day the person still they refuse? Okay, oh, because not, let, let me. Uh, there's mm. a case on ground now with a particular mm. celebrity. Mm. Where a woman been come out and mm. he talks say five years ago, 
I've been get picking for you. Mm. You understand? I never... And as a matter of fact, they claim say they be do DNA, and uh, it, which came out negative, and uh, 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 it be favor the man side. But do man they claim say the DNA where they talk say na lie say fingers touch him. No be the original one come out. So now I claim be say now you know they take care of the picking. Mm. Do you understand? Like the guy know they take care of the picking. Mm. They reach out to the picking. As a matter of fact, the guy does not even want to have anything to do with the child. Mm. So now what I'm asking is. Is it possible for that woman now to say, okay, oh, even if we are not married, but I get picking for you, I won't carry you go court, say, I won't make you day responsible for the upkeep of this child. Mm. And then waiting the response of the court would be to such a case. Like, mm. is it treatable under the no, law? No, 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 because, okay, for instance, uh, the first thing I will do is say, for that kind of case, mm. if I can even establish, say, I like that question, no, that kind of way. No, if we if, 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 do be saying, now, now, paternity case, now, for, for the determination, of paternity. Okay. So you can go to court to say like, uh, court, I, uh, even the mom say, I can say, look, this man is claiming, say, let me get this wow. became. And I want the court to make an official pronouncement, say, let me get her. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the court goes, okay, to make that official pronouncement, we'll go do DNA. You can order a DNA test. And the man can say, okay, well, I submit to it or I don't submit to it. So it's on the basis of that. Or if, say, that woman come to, can go to court and say, okay, Though we are not married, though, mm. but I want a special order to compel this man. Say, make him give me money okay. for this child to take care of this child. Uh, then the man can come and say, okay, this child, though, I still have a doubt whether I'm a child or not. No. Okay, court, the first thing I want me to do, let us even determine the paternity of this child. It's in the same case, so now the woman bring yeah. the case. So that way, also, okay, determine the paternity. So the court will give order, say, you know, and nowadays, the DNA test now very easy to, to do. One one pam, do drum, pam pam. So you go drum, and before for the go Canada go do that kind of thing. Now here you drum. So if you drum, you determine. So when you don't determine, it's okay. Now positive, now him the father. Mm -hmm. So you cannot compare the court now that it has been determined. Then compel him to 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 give to yeah. give number one recognition to this child, and number two, um, um, what do you call them? Maintenance. Because sometimes some women, what they even want for that child, not even the com not even the um, the maintenance. What they want is that acknowledgement by that now man. See now you're picking so that for the psychological uh, uh, trauma. trauma of that child to be reduced because he doesn't know the father and you want the child to look this is your father. Yeah. And if the child the father keeps saying that I'm not, not your father, father, I'm not your father. Mm -hmm. So it becomes the case that man, I mean, I have some uh, women, uh, uh, children, boy, child, child, who became very, um, some of them even nearly maimed the mother uh, okay. because of the father, like, where's, my, where's, my, mm. where's my father? So it has to be well treated in the way that, so it's possible that you can say, but can't just go to court because you say, let I me mean, I mean give you, let me give you a baby with this one. You can't just go to court and say, court to compel the person to start pay, paying the money, mm. you know. But that kind of, I like, like that question, we say, if you carry that matter go, uh, welfare. Mm. Most time, welfare go they they confused because they never even determine the paternity. Uh -huh. So now court go fit determine that because like I said that uh, welfare na place of persuasion. persuasion. Mm. So if now if the thing fail, you can always go back to the court to go and say okay we have we have gone to that place at least mediatory for mediation, but it didn't work. So we are coming back. We are coming to court now. To give a final order. Right, order. Yeah. Before you go further, uh, the phone lines are officially open. Uh, feel free call in in case you want to ask Barista any questions. Yeah. We get Barista Tommy Vincent here. Of course, you can talk to him personally should you want to. You know, if you don't say, ah, I don't want people to hear what I want to say, you can send him a <laughs> message privately. You know, on WhatsApp. Of course, uh, the phone line zero eight one zero five four three four nine eight four or zero eight one seven three yeah. one <laughs> four seven. Have I turned down your TV volume, yeah, please? So. And please, let it be centered around mm -hmm. marriage. What did they talk mm -hmm. about yeah. this morning? Mm -hmm. Okay, so very sad. But now, another another case where I would like to bring, now mm -hmm. that of maybe a man where no agree accept the paternity of a particular child mm -hmm. and he failed in fulfilling his responsibilities as a father. Now, over the years, the woman being personally train the picking, mm. maybe even to university and all of that. And then the man now they come from space 
to come claim ownership. Maybe when the picking don't they do it. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So that kind of thing, I can do man say no. Because I, maybe she even like refused the child from bearing the name of the father because mm -hmm. he wasn't responsible. You know, so now you can't they come from space and say, okay, no, it's my child. Just because maybe they see the picking for TV or they hear the picking. You understand that kind of thing? So is it possible for that woman to say no since you know Grey accept the responsibility from birth? Um, I am not going to accept you as a father to the child. Okay, you know, child, child in the court of child mm. are from 1 to 18. Okay. After 18, mm. you don't get a child. Okay. That person has the right to determine what he wants. You can say that that man is his, his father. You can go and meet the guy and reconcile. Mm -hmm. I understand mm. you. It can be that he has been yearning for father oh. for all his life. Mm. And then suddenly the man says that, which is most likely, the man says, yeah, it was a mistake. I didn't even understand what I was doing. So uh, that, for this case now, mm. that the Peking now go determine whether he was yeah, father or not. Yeah, because Peking don't come out. Now you call him Peking. Um, okay, uh, now the child. Once you, don't the... Become, once you don't become 18, uh, that, that you don't get, you know, you have the right, you know, to, you right. Has the right to say, I see I acknowledge that man and my father. father. He, he has, has the right. right to say otherwise. Too. Yes, now. But you go pain the mama and say, okay, I don't uh -huh, train this child. Uh -huh, I thought this uh, But most times, and that's in 98% uh, of the times, mm. the children still they go back with meet, meet the father. Or well, probably mm. they go forgive the father yeah. later because yeah. um, everybody yearns for father. Yeah, sure, sure. Everybody. So, no, no, there's nothing you can really say that um, at the point at the point in time, and, and most times go start that women they suffer most. Women go yeah. try, 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 keep their children, raise them, raise them, and suddenly just the man will appear. At, at the day, excuse me, at the day of uh, wedding, wedding, or at the day of uh, graduation, yeah. or at the day of inauguration, or you something like that. Ownership. You claim ownership. And you know, because you want to say, that's my stock, that's where I come from. <laughs> <And think>. stock. <laughs> nah, so. Mm. so, the other things about children, <coughs> we want to talk, say, um, now, when there's a remarriage, very important. Um, my advice is that before you even remarry, somebody who don't get child before, mm. think very deeply. Why? Why? You know, Daisy. So remarry? Uh, yeah, I mean, okay, let's say, because I'm talking about a few marriage and yeah. children. Mm. So let's say the man don't get child yeah, before. Yes. Mm. Or let's say the woman don't get child Thank before. Uh, mm. And the marriage or relationship with the day before don't fail. Mm. So now enter a one. new one. one. Open your eyes very well and think deep very well. Because most times is not the easiest. Mm -hmm. Right, sir, please. Uh, yeah. We have Mrs. Mrs. John. Okay. Good morning, Mrs. John. Ma. Good morning, ma. Hello, Mrs. Good John. Ma. Hello, Ma. Hello, Ma. Good, Good morning. morning. Yes, Ma. All right. Please, I love your program. Thank you so much. Uh, please, I wanted to talk about uh, maybe a father. Are you hearing me? Yes, yes we're hearing. Go on. Uh, maybe a father, if someone fragmented a lady mm -hmm. and is for long. Maybe in that a month, nine months later, mm. you get what I'm saying? Yes, I'm getting. And uh, nine months later, mm. the lady now came back. Is that time you now tell the the, the man that ah, I'm pregnant? Oh. Ah, the boy with. Oh. Okay, okay. So it's after. It, when she gave blood, she be hiding for the man. Okay, came no, back. You know, change. You know, change. I don't think it changes <coughs> anything much because. Except well, in most cases, hmm? the people who give and belay good lies, it not be me. Why you no come out this way? Why you no tell me? Lie. Other now. men don't reject and come they find who you go rope. Uh, it doesn't change anything. That's why when the, if the paternity of a child yeah. can be okay. determined, that's true, sure. Uh, not change anything. You get one case where I didn't involve like that. The man denied to the youth saying I didn't get the belay, <laughs> so we can't go talk to the man. This is the doubt time, the doubt time. Mm -hmm. But when the baby come, eh, na carbon copy of the man. Drop him. Yeah, carbon copy, carbon copy. So, you don't change anything at all. Don't change anything. But you know, I just say, uh, many girls when they go get belay for people will be say, they don't, they don't go marry. You see, they, 
That's why they cost all our later. That's why they talk about children and field relationship. Mm. Um, so you, you bring one child, come. Some men go say, or some women, okay, let's put that, let's talk about men. Some men mm. know they like the idea, say, uh, the woman will get belly, okay. or don't get children before. If I get one case where I know, we say, the woman no tell the man, <laughs> say that child nine child. Yeah. And now by mistake, the man know <laughs> through the man's father. Mm -mm. Yeah. No. Through the woman's father. Go Esther. Mm. Hello, Esther. <clears throat> Hello. Good morning, Esther. Good morning. <clears throat> Thank you so much for calling. Please go on. Yo, okay. Hello, good morning. Morning. Yes, morning, ma'am. I'm calling from Lagos. Okay, ma'am. I'm calling on behalf of a friend. She oh. actually have an issue, although the man died like um, two weeks ago, mm -hmm. and then um, her children, they are in the village, in the hands of the uh, mother-in-law. Mm -hmm. Before the man passed away like two weeks ago, mm -hmm. he, they have been having series of issues. They've even gone to welfare to um, talk about the children, to talk about the family. What happened is the man actually had his family members, his brothers, his sisters in the house, and the place is always too busy. So the woman was not comfortable with it. So when they got to welfare, they told the man they should go to another apartment and let those people go and get another apartment so that they can groom their family by themselves. Mm. But the man was not okay with it. They were accusing the woman, they are a witch, blah, 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 things like that. So at the end of the day, now the man is dead. Mm. And now they are with her children. So how can she get the custody of her children back? Mm. Oh, she, she, she can. That will have to take go, go to court. She can go to court for that. that look, I need the custody in that sense. Is a plain uh, uh, trying to because there's no marriage again since the man has died. Okay, I just want my children back. I have the right to go to those children. And so I think for her, this time around, uh, going to welfare, it will not help her mm -hmm. that much because of the fact that the welfare issue uh, cannot, they cannot persuade them. They are not part of the marriage. You know, so I think she just get a lawyer and she can go and get a court order. And she can prove her case that this she's the owner of the I mean, she's she the has the better. <coughs> she can undo the welfare. I mean, welfare of the children very well. And if you can do that, then the court will give that order. That order she can use to go to the family and claim those children from this one. Otherwise, it might be very difficult for her to claim the children from them. In a case where it's not a legal marriage, mm. where it's I like, marriage. Oh, I like that question. In the later, you know, in this in this sense, you're not even talking about marriage again. You're talking about the rights, the rights of the children. children. So, under uh, some laws, I mean, legal sense kind of law, you can under that law say, I'm not going because of marriage again. I'm going because of the interests and the rights mm. of these children, mm. which is a different thing from is a full marriage. This yeah. one is a, is a marriage that is ended mm. by death. So it's about the children now. So you can do do that, you know. Okay. Uh, so I was talking about, okay, so. Uh, that it took time to to announce pregnancy yeah. does not change the fact of the paternity. Does not change. Mm -hmm. Does not change. In fact, some people will say because I know that he's going to advise me to abort it. I don't want to tell mm -hmm. him. I didn't want to tell him mm -hmm. about it so that it was, it was well advanced. And for some people, they don't even want him to know at all. Mm -hmm. I've known people like that. I say I didn't let him know. He didn't even know that he has a child. You know, because mm. his mother would deliberate. deliberate. Mm. Okay. They didn't allow him to know that he has a child from them. And the man did not even know he has a child. Mm. It was much yeah. later yeah, that they brought out the father, ah, this is a child that you left, you know. And why didn't tell me? Because if I told you, this and this and that, and that but I wanted to keep your child. And things like that. So it's, it's very possible in that sense. In that sense, the mother was not, the woman was not even looking for any custody, mm. any, any maintenance. It was not looking for maintenance issue or whatever. Just took care of the child, and when the child grew up, the man got to know that he has a child uh, and what have you. So now we're talking about. Master, before you go further, now in a case of something like this, mm. say I get belay for one man, mm. I no can tell. Maybe the king gonna be like seven months, belay don't big, rather mm. I never born. Mm. I can't go meet the boy. Say ah, eh, Ogbeni, now you get this belay, oh, you know. Mm. And the boy can say no. Why you no come since first month? Second month, you can't come seven months. Mm. Now if I can't carry this matter, I go court, you know. Now, which one, why you want to go? Okay, okay, one okay. So, may, okay, maybe I'll carry and go. Uh, uh, welfare. Welfare. Mm -hmm. Now, we say, okay. So now, in that instance, if the guy they compel the guy or advise the guy to the give me money, you know, for antinanta and kinikon kinikon, I can't burn the child. 
the shy no come be the guy on low talk. Waiting, they happen mm -hmm. after that time. No, but before you answer that, let's take you, Yusuf. <coughs> Hello, Yusuf. Yeah. yeah, good morning. Good, good morning. morning. Good morning. Yeah. Hello, I, just, I want to contribute. I want to ask a question on the topic being discussed. Well, well, there you go. On. My question is, in the case of this would between husband and wife, mm -hmm. the children involved, have they the right, have they any right to decide which of the parents they want to stay with? Uh, okay, yeah. uh, yes. I've answered that earlier. Um, my prayer is that me uh, it, 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 it should you not don't happen. Get to that stage. Uh, it should <laughs> happen because you always leave a trauma on the children's psychology. But if that comes to cat, you know, uh, it depends on your marriage, really. Customary marriage, you know, go customary court, go determine them. Uh, legal marriage, you know, go go uh, legal marriage. But between the family, it's also possible that children can say, okay. Without even going to court, me, I will go with my mama. Mm. Uh, me, I will go with my father. And if the two parties can say, okay, that's okay, it's okay. Um, it has also, it's not, it's not a bad um, uh, in that settlement, but it's not the best yeah. option. So making a try patch up <laughs> to retain that interest. And but that's why our mothers in the past, our mothers in the past, mm. you can give kudos to them. They will <laughs> say that if not for these children, I don't, mm. know. I, don't, I don't hear that kind of thing before. <laughs> if not for these children. Hey, uh, because that uh, because <laughs> most times, uh, once you leave, it's that it damages the child. Yeah. It damages the child. You know, where's your mother? My mother is somewhere else. Where's your, where's your, who's born like this one? Uh, my father's mm. my second wife. My wife, my father's second wife. You know, so that kind of things like that. So it damages them. That's why the women will understand it. They say, look, I will stay here. I'll go through this, but nowadays he says that one has rule it. Nowadays now. Nowadays now, Lua Sho. Lua Sho go. No so, so, uh, so, now when I was trying to tell you that when the first, when the man has a child and the woman has a child mm -hmm. and, they, and they're going to marry, so I was giving that instance of the man was not told about the baby. baby. Of that woman, it was by mistake. the The father of the woman was telling the husband, "Sir, when are you guys coming to pick your child?" Hmm. That's when he said, ah, "Which child?" And I'm talking about the marriage span almost about 35 years hmm. before one of the spouses died. The husband never acknowledged the first child. Hmm. Never. In fact, the children of the second marriage. Would not even know that the that the that boy yeah. they are calling brother mm. was even their eldest brother. They would not know because nobody told them. Mm. Even you know to the extent that when there was a burial of one of the spouses, the first child could not participate mm. as a child. That was how much you can you can imagine the torture, yeah. life like torture because of the mistake. So when there's a failed marriage or failed relationship, and you're bringing another child, the child or children, it's better you lay the cards on the table. That's Very a well. That's a piece. Um, hello, Abdul. Abdul. Good morning. Yeah. Abdul. Good morning. Good morning. Mm -hmm. Good morning. Good morning. My people, my people, how are they? We are healthy. Good morning. So I, I want to ask uh, the barista. Okay. okay. Okay, you know, in Islam, our Muslim uh, uh, religion, you yeah. can marry up to four wives. Yes, yes. But uh, there are situations where maybe after the four, you have other ones, other concubines, no, additional wives. Yeah. And in law, I believe they say that uh, after the first four, mm. whatever happened to between you and the rest are illegal. Is that uh, terrible in the law? Yeah, I, I am not very sure of that, because um, is the that is about Sharia and the... Muslim type of customary court, but I'm not very sure about what happens to this, the children of the concubines. But I know for a fact that in Nigerian constitution, no child is called illegitimate. Mm -hmm. Abdul, no child is yeah, regarded as illegitimate. So it's just a matter of when you are probably writing your will, you acknowledge the children, you acknowledge mm -hmm. them that my child, my this my child, this my child, this my child. But not to the extent of saying that they are, they are illegitimate children. 
And of course, also remember that in customary, uh, like I was saying when I started, customary and religious marriage are almost on the same bracket. Mm -hmm. So customary in your religion, it says four. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. customary is like limitless number of wives can be married yeah. by man. So in that sense, you know, those children are still your children. That's what I would say. Okay. Mm. Thank all you. right, thank you. Is, is that is all? all right, yeah, yeah, okay for now. Okay. All right, for now. <laughs> okay. okay. All right, so so making a try anytime when I want to that kind of marriage, please, I beg you all, um, interest, just let your children. And see, for the woman who is marrying a man who has had children before, take it that is, is a given that your children will not be the first set of children. And in that sense, for sake of humanity, you should not be mean to those other children. Mm. Please, because it's a given that they were there before your children come. Mm. So you need to try for the sake of legacy, good memories, yeah. help those children, integrate them, put all your children, I mean the children in the right perspective. Don't put your children ahead of the other children. And then it might be difficult for you to get integrate mm. them but that's part of the you know um barista some baby mamas can be nasty i know now I know. he is a man that gave a gay belly they didn't marry mm. he gets shy now this man can say okay oh, you don't born for me i do not intend to marry you i will take care of the shy now mm. i want to marry somebody else now why would a man be married even though the man is the father of your shy mm -hmm. you now be calling the man at 12 30 a.m hello John, ah, your shy body is hot. So she says she wants to see. Your shy wants to see you. And they that time that that how does the wife in the house, the legal wife, how sh should she handle such issues? Because some um, baby mama can be somehow. They can, oh, they do not be calling 2 a.m. Or they don't say, ah, no, the school said no, the father must come. Oh, or once, yeah, you do. But, you know, calling at odd hours, trying to do some things where you can do yourself normally. But no, because she just want the man not to be with that woman. You say the man need to show face. Say he shot. She shot my daddy. I will die. I will die. Let, let, let me even add, let me add to what she just said. Is it possible for that woman? More as you say, the man don't remarry. Uh, yeah. Is it possible for that woman to say she doesn't want to have anything to do with the child? Like I don't want to see the picking. I don't want you to have any relationship. Or maybe she will even get to that stage where she will tell the man to choose either for, either the guy choose her or he hold on to the picking because no one anything will go affect her present uh, family. Uh, that, that's why they say that um, is is for many men and for many men. It's a very uh, you know this topic about mm -hmm. children. Um, <laughs> it's a very very psychologically traumatizing yeah. thing yeah. for many yeah. children. Okay, now you are telling the wife, mm -hmm. you are telling your husband, mm -hmm. choose whether between me and that child. Mm -hmm. I, I can understand whether I private and not marry, mm -hmm. and then the man went to have a baby outside. Mm -hmm. It's painful. painful. But the real truth is that, yes, it is a marriage. Mm -hmm. It is a marriage, and the two of you are in that marriage. Mm -hmm. And the man goes out to have a baby mama. Mm -hmm. eh? That can be a base of divorce, because mm -hmm. that's adultery. I understand mm -hmm. it. But sometimes, if that is done, <coughs> the child outside yeah. has to be, you know, it's not, it cannot be visited with the sin of the father. Mm -hmm. That's my own advice. So even though it's a wrong thing, it's not you can say, I want this marriage terminated because of this. Or I've forgiven him, but, uh, but I also will have to allow that child to. Of course, like we said, some the woman outside who knows what she has entered, of course, does not have the right to be doing what she's doing. Mm. Because if you knew the man was married, except you know the man was married, even if you no, don't know. No, they had a child before he married before his he married new wife. Woman. No, man. Oh, in that sense, in that sense, didn't the other, didn't the woman, I don't know, because I know that some men... No, but some men might not open wife, up a house, no get issue. Mm -hmm. The wife don't assess, okay, before I marry this, my young girl shied. Mm -hmm. But the baby mama will not allow them to have a peaceful I, marriage. I know, I know, it's, it's wrong. It's very, very wrong. Once you don't have the marriage, mm -hmm. it's wrong. But so that, that's why the man can make it a final thing by going to court this way. Court, give me, uh, let's determine the custody of this child. Mm -hmm. If this woman cannot take care of the child, I want to have the child. Okay. So you can say, okay, I want to have the child and have the custody. Of course, the woman will struggle, say, no, yeah. no, another woman cannot raise my child. Mm. Okay, if that is the case, stay with the child. Okay, these are the terms. I'll give oh. you maintenance, I'll give you this one. Mm. Everything has to be the child, you take care of the child. On that basis. So, court can also 
put that yeah, line across. Okay. And of course, it's awful. Baby, Duma had uh, hope that the man will be his yeah, man. Exactly. Uh, and things like But that's why, even the woman that's going to marry that kind of man, if he opens up, Think about it very exactly. well because this will never stop happening. They'll always be attached. They'll exactly. never, they so. never stop happening. That's why children and free relationships, it's something. And that's why the law has been brought up clearly now to have protection of, protection of children's, children's rights. We will mm. say, you talk about all these kind of things, possibility, uh, violence nowadays, yeah. uh, you know, and that woman's child is with you and yeah. you're beating her. Mm. A neighbor mm. can call and say, look, yeah, this sure. woman. Yeah. So these are all mm. the possibilities. And because you see, once you have another person's child living with you, that is not. It, you have to be very careful because people will say, "Ah, he's using his child." Mm -hmm. Even what you can, what you probably even are even beating your child more. Yeah. You understand? We say, "Oh, now nah, it's because it's another man." So these are all the things that the, the dynamics okay. have to be brought into play when you are talking about the right interests of children as you move on into another another relationship. Because it's a bad one when you don't think about it. For the man, for the woman. Oh. For the woman, open up to your man before he goes, I have other children, no. And for the man, let your wife know that you have other children. Yeah. So that when you are entering that uh, marriage, you are able to put position um, those the rights of those children okay. and they don't suffer. In that, in that sense. Okay, Barista, my, my last question. Mm. Eh, I, try, I don't try reason I go take put mm. and says. Now, imagine, say, maybe the man die. You mm. know, she was married to a particular man, then he died. And he died without anything. Like, there was no will because he didn't get anything. And mm. then she got married to another man. And on a good note, the man be accept those children. Now, God forbid, if the man... Okay, man say the man can't write in will. Does he have every right? Is he compelled under the law? to infuse the names of those children we come from outside into in will. And then if he doesn't, mm. is there any penalty for that? Like, okay, the children will come... Will, from will, outside. After marriage. Do you marriage. understand? After marriage. Like, he now got married to their mother and mm. he do them legally this mm. time. So now, is he compelled under the law to also infuse the names of those children? Where the, where the woman mm. bring? Yeah, from mm. outside oh, into no, the present. No, it all depends on relationship. Just okay. It's all okay. different because some men go even adopt the children of the former wife. As their own children. Yeah. Okay. I, I know of a judge whose, whose mother, my, today the judge, mm. was raised by the mother's wife, uh, the mother's husband. Okay. Wow. Not his own father? No. And um, the man today is still bearing her mother's maiden name. Mm. The mother had another 10 children for the, her husband, but that man raised him, raised him. Raised, Took him to uh, uh, send him to abroad for law. He's now a judge, hmm. a wow. judge. Understanding me. Good. And when he died, he gave this man part of his estate. He even gave him land, gave him, gave him to raise him. So now, now this, this, this judge does hmm. he bear that man's name? No, he bears his mother, wow. oh. his mother's maiden name. And the man doesn't have an issue with that. No, 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 no. Okay. All so true. Good people, wow. All true. He raised that child as his own child, but allowed the child to bear. Wow. That wow. the mother's the mother's name. So the, the justice is bearing that name, but all the other children mm. call him their brother. Okay. And they're all they are all successful in their own rights. Okay. I understand you. Yeah. So he was raised with that child. So it's all possibilities, but you bring it this into the fore so that the interest of the children is not um is not uh, disturbed. Mm. So anybody can call me and send um, um SMS or whatever. Mm. I was trying to answer the question. Or right. well, take care of these children. Because that's the future, yeah. and they might remember you and do much more yeah, than what you can up. even think about. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> that's how far we can go for Lega Mata today. Barrister shall be here next week, Wednesday. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs>